How's it going, my dreamers? This is Born to Dream, back with episode number 39 of the Pokemon Prism Nuzlocke. Be sure to leave a like down below if you're enjoying the video, subscribe for some more Pokemon content, and be sure to check out the playlist in the description down below if you'd like to see any previous episodes of the Pokemon Prism Nuzlocke. Um, so today, we will be going ahead and we will take on Whitney today, but I forgot to mention something last episode, and this is pretty important in my opinion. Um, I finally, finally, after thousands, maybe not thousands, but after a lot of Pokemon um, deposited, I now have this Ryalu here, and I call it Sensei, because why the fuck not? And uh, yeah, so I have this Ryalu now. And um, at some point, I'm going to have to evolve that into Lucario. Especially if things go bad. But um, I have the Rylu now. So um, I can't claim anything else from that donation thing. I said when I... I think I said when I got there that I was going for the Rylu. I saw I got the Rylu. So yeah. I'm not going to take any other Pokemon from there. So, um, But here's the team. And all their moves. There's Judy. Looking nice and fresh. Nice and pretty. Um, yeah, so today we will be taking on Whitney. And uh, I don't know how to approach Whitney. Because I don't know if she's going to be running fairies. Or if she'll be running uh, normal types. So I would assume... I would assume... She'd be running normal. But I don't want to be too sure. I'm going to go in here with... Uh, Judy and see what the deck or what the deck what the gym looks like. I've been playing way too much Yu-Gi-Oh! Duel Links. Um Uh so let's go ahead and do this. This doesn't look like her typical gym. So let's see, objective event. Okay, that was worthless. I can't wait to see your cute Pokemon. My Pokemon won't hold back. Okay. So let's see what you got, see what you got, see what you got. Fur it. Okay. Definitely looks like it's going to be a normal type gym. But I don't want to be too sure. I do not want to be too sure. Because there could be that fairy that pops up out of the middle of nowhere. You know? Can't use Endure twice, buddy. You can, but you have like a 75% chance of hitting it. Which is essentially like the equivalent of like hitting the thunder outside of the rain. Look at Brave Fur though. Lord. Oh my lord. Judy's gonna get so strong, dude. Judy will probably be the first level 100. I'm gonna say that right now. If we make it to that point where I have to have level 100, Judy will probably be the first level 100. Um, let's go for a crystal bolt. Double edge. Oh lord. I uh, didn't do anything. Good. Um, they seem to be a little weaker at, uh, Whitney's gym than they are at Bugsy's. <clears throat> Which is interesting. Uh, the Pokemon, that is. So, yeah, let's go into... I think I can go into Judy. I think I can go into Judy? Because normal's super effective against, uh... Against... Sound. Let's go for let's go for steel wing. Are you serious? Mustard gas. That's disgusting. Let's go for the steel wing. Oh, it's not. Play rough. Okay, we're good. Uh, let's go ahead and heal. And uh, we'll use fly. I'm gonna screw around with the sound for a sec. There we go, that's better. Alright. So, let's see, does this take it out? Nope. We can go for the quick attack and win, pretty sure. Yeah, there we go. There we go. Too bad Judy doesn't have a, um, doesn't have double edge. I think I'd prefer that over Brave Bird, at least in this game. At least in this game. Uh, I think I'm gonna go in with, uh, Glade here. Let's see what you got. Give it your best shot, because I will. Okay. 
Why does Whitney's gym feel like the same setup as Blue's? That's interesting. Alright, so I'm gonna switch because I know this Wigglytuff has play rough, so I don't want to mess with that. Um, I'm gonna actually go into... I think I'll go into Slowbro. I don't know. Slowbro might work. Let's see. What can Slowbro do? Should have checked that first before. Oh yeah, that's right. Freeze burn. Let's go for. Let's go for it. Fuck it. Oh god. Okay, actually, that's a bad idea. <laughs> um, can I get a burn? No. Uh, let's go for. Let's go for Ampros. Let's go for Ampros. Hyper voice. Should be okay. Yeah, we're okay. Alright. Go ahead and heal. Oh, mustard gas. Oh, come on, man. Awesome. Alright. So, yeah, it definitely looks like this is gonna be a normal gym. Low bunny! Alright, we're going to Glade then. Could, like, Low bunny learn any ghost moves? It could learn play rough. I'm sure this thing can learn play rough. I would be surprised if it couldn't. I'd be very surprised, actually. But we took it out, and I think the crit mattered. <laughs> I'm pretty sure the crit mattered, but I'm not complaining. Alright. Beauty Bridget was defeated. Oh, no! Alright. So, let's see. I, didn't, I was expecting to see at least one Clefable. At least one. And I did not see one. So, does that mean Whitney won't have a Clefable? We'll have to see. We will have to see. Alright, let's, let's see what you got. Hi, I'm Whitney. I got into Pokemon years ago because everyone else was into it. I think that's what she normally says in the other version. Guess it wasn't just a silly fad. I've gotten cuter and stronger over the years, so if you want my badge, you're going to have to earn it. Let's do it. Do, 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 do. Oh, you have a wiggly top. Okay. Come back. Come back, Greg. I'm gonna go into Ampharos. This guy. You're really gonna use Charm? This is a level 79 Wigglytuff, and you're gonna use Charm. Alright. Alright. Nice. Ampharos is really strong. It's a really good Pokemon. Snorlax! I think Snorlax can actually learn Shadow Ball. I think it can. But I'm gonna use one Swords Dance. And let's see. Belly drum! Oh, this is not good. This is not good. We gotta go straight for the dream punch. Good. I'm not fucking with that. <laughs> I'm not fucking with that, because that Snorlax probably could have swept my team. Is that really her best Pokemon? Because usually, like, the last... Poke, like the Pokemon on the far end is like the uh, is like the what? What do you call it again? I fr freaking forgot. Is their best Pokemon? I forgot the term that you use in like literally every single Pokemon Let's Play. Blissey. Oh, okay. I see these everywhere in Pokemon Go. I see Snorlaxes everywhere in Pokemon Go too, but it looks like she has pure normal types though. And I'm just drain punching all of them. <laughs> 4,000 experience. Please give that experience to me. Porygon Z. I'm gonna stick with Glade. Although I'm very terrified. Because Por Porygon Z is not a Pokemon to fuck with. But I think I can one shot it. It is not a Pokemon to fuck with. I've had enough experiences with Porygon Z to know that. Analytic, uh. Hyper Beam is kind of OP, at least in Let's Play. <laughs> hey, that was good. I'm not going to cry. You earned my badge. Oh, thank God. She must have gone. She must have matured a bit. 
I'm all out of those TMs, but you can have this instead. Oh! Hey, check that out. The Magnet Pass will allow you to take the Magnet Train back and forth from Johto to Kanto as many times as you want. I would go myself, but they tied up security in Saffron City. Is that so? Hmm, I wonder why. I wonder why they did that. Alright, let's see, uh, let's see what's over in Saffron City. I'm gonna assume that I can only go to Saffron City. Just based on, just based on this. Cause Sabrina's the only one there. So, unless they have a new gym leader in Kanto, which would be kind of surprising. Uh, I'm gonna say that she's the only one. Uh, I did not mean to do that. Go to Kanto, please. Yeah, he's like, dancing there. Alright. Alright, well now we're in Kanto. Two episodes later, we're in Kanto. Can I go up here? I cannot. Sorry, nobody's allowed to pass this point for now. Feel free to enjoy so everything. So offer. Okay. I'm gonna assume that it's gonna be the same over here. Yeah, and it's gonna be the same for Vermillion. Yep, and then L Lavender Town. Lavender Town is blocked off. Alright. Just wanted to check that to be absolutely sure. It looks like Saffron City is the only place we can go to. So, let's go ahead and check the place out. Um, we already were in here. I'm going to guess that maybe the candle starters are here. I'm copycat. I don't mimic more, but I like Pokemon dolls. Okay. I'm going to... Ooh, look, a Gengar doll. And a Caterpie doll. And a Pikachu doll. But, yeah, I'm kind of going out on a limb and saying that the Kano starters are here. Somewhere in the city here. Um, just a random guess. Ooh. What's up, buddy? You're not allowed down here. Sorry, I can't. Okay. This was my first guess. I'm afraid we don't offer SP2. Wait, don't leave just yet. Blue? Allow me to introduce myself. My name is Mr. Oak. Mr. Oak. He doesn't call himself Blue anymore. Alright. I've heard about you before. Lance is your father, right? Yeah, and I'm Lance Jr. After I fought him, I became the champion for a short time until that red got in the way. While I still battle on the side, I've become more interested in developing environmentally friendly projects. I, stu <clears throat> I study abroad in Kalos, and when I returned, I was offered this position. Gramps had some pretty strong connections. Come, let me show you my latest project. Okay, that was quick. We've gone through several prototypes when trying to develop the perfect Pokeball. Since I took over, I made the company environmentally friendly. It delayed the retail version of the Master Ball. However, I think we're finally there. We finished the first retail version of this ball and... Wait, this isn't right. It's missing a chip. The guy in charge of that said he did this already. Lance, is it... I'm sorry, but can you go look for him? He's probably somewhere in Saffron City. Thank you, and if you find him, I might make it worth your while. Okay. I wonder who it is. I wonder who this person is that we have to go find a chip for. I guess we can't go any further. Alright. Oh, we get to check out more of this place. Not bad. Let's see. Any items around? Anything crazy? doesn't look like it, it just looks like another floor. Uh, that's up, I wanna go down. Alright, we're out. Okay. That was slightly unexpected, I was not expecting Blue to do that, but... I guess we'll have to look around and find this guy. Hey, thank you, I got TM Psychic. Nice. What's up, buddy? Moved into town. He used to be the. Oh. Oh, oh, that's blue. I was thinking like 
Wait, is Giovanni here too? But no, it's not Giovanni. Wait, what? I heard that some legendary trainers live on a secret island. It's a rumor since nobody knows where they are these days. Okay. Yo, used to be the champion of the Kanto. Talk about an impressive resume. Yeah, I'd say that's pretty impressive. Okay. Wonder where this guy is. People from Najo are so wi wild and exciting. I would tend to agree. For scary reasons, they don't allow people who are from outside Kanto to leave the city. Ah, that explains it. Alright. Very called Gold once visited Saffron and he showed me how to be stronger. I was able to defeat the leader of the fighting dojo, but Sabrina is still too much for me. It's always exciting to meet visitors from faraway regions. Okay. Let's see. Exciting living in a big city like this. That's okay. <laughs> I'm trying to find this guy. I don't know where he would be. Maybe Copcat? <laughs> okay, probably not Copcat. Um, I would guess that the person of interest is in here. Well, it's definitely gym worthy. Let's see. Where might you come from? Where might you come from? Okay, let's let's see the levels. So it's a Machamp, let's see the levels. 80, okay, that's that's good. That's good. Um I'm just gonna go straight for the psycho cut. I don't know if this will one shot, but it will certainly do a lot, and it did. Cool. Let's see. Machamp again. Is this gym just gonna be all Machamps? <laughs> Alright, level 82 Machamp is gone. Cool, I can just literally. Greg has just been in hogging most of this episode. <laughs> I mean, I fought like a normal type gym and then I fought a fighting type gym. Greg does well against both, so I don't know what to say about that. Do you like your mouth or fist? Do you let your mouth or fist do the talking? Mm, probably my mouth. <laughs> Alright, so we have Machamp. It's literally all Machamps. Okay. Can I see something that's not a Machamp? Machamp's a cool Pokemon and all, and I know it's a fighting type, but there's about, I don't know, 10 or 15 other fight fighting types you could have. Hitmonlee is one of them. Okay. <laughs> Alright. We have a Hitmonlee here. Still one shot. <laughs> Greg is gonna gain so much experience. Holy shit, man. Alright. I I take it it's the ladder. Uh sure if you wanna interpret it that way. Are you ready to face the master? I'd like to think so. Not a champ. For Loom. Okay. So, is the master gonna have, like, all the Hitmons? Is that how we're gonna do this? And then I get a Tyrogue? Is that how this goes? I wouldn't mind a Tyrogue. I'll take a Tyrogue. I don't care. I don't really care. Hitmon Top's kinda dope. I would hope to be a Hitmon Top. Uh, Glade. Alright, this is where we switch. Let's go to Judy. And we'll go ahead and probably just Brave Bird it on. No, we don't need a Brave Bird. Let's just go for Fly. Brave Bird is overkill, and I'd rather not. If Fly can take it out, then Fly is going to take it out. Like, you know. Alright, so. Let's see. Now we have Machamp. Machamp's at the very end this time. I'm not going to slow, bro. It's going to make sense. Nah. We'll go into Greg. Go to Greg. Man, this is a level 84, but I still think it's gonna take it out. Oh, come on! 
Alright, well, I, I'm actually gonna switch because I'm not fucking with confusion. Alright. So let's go for Surf. Oh, wait. Going into Slowbro was probably the bad idea. Oh, just kidding. I took it out. Cool. And they're both gonna grow a level. That's pretty awesome. I would say. I would say. Yes, you are. Okay. <laughs> Let's, uh, head back down here. Go to the Pokemon Center. Alright. So I wonder what you are going to give me if I beat you. Or if you're the guy Blue is looking for, one of the two. Um, let's see. Doesn't look like there's anything of interest here other than him. So, we'll go ahead and save. And then, I think, I'm gonna go with Slowbro. And we'll take him on. Hey! I'm Kaio, the Karate King. You! Battle time! hi -ya! Alright, how many Pokemon are you going to have, buddy? Three? Cool. So, yeah, it looks like you're going to have all the Hitmons. Hitmon Lee, Hitmon Chan, Hitmon Top. That would be my guess. High Jump Kick. Okay, that's not doing anything. I don't really want to use Slowbro too much because Slowbro is so slow and it's going to take a lot of chip damage. Like... I just got critted. I was gonna say, he probably would've been at like 150, so I took like 120 damage. Just from trying to take out this Hitmonlee. It's like, Slowbro is a good Pokemon, but it's so slow that it's just, I don't know, it's just kinda hard to use, I guess. Because of its slowness. But, eh. Let's go into Greg. Greg can go for, I'm gonna go for a Swords Dance. Because Hitmonchan does have pretty good physical defense, so I think it would be a good idea just to go for a sword stance, just to be safe, just to make sure I secure the win here. Because I'm assuming the next one's going to be him on top. Him on top, okay. But him on top has intimidate. Oh, it's not. It's not using it. Okay. Awesome. So, was defeated. I'm beaten. Black. I'm crushed. You earned this belt. That's all I get. It'll make your fighting Pokemon even more powerful. That's all I get. He literally took his belt off and like. Here you go. This is what you get for beating me. You couldn't give me a Tyro? Whatever. I still want to know where this guy is. Where could he be? Did I talk to everyone in here? Like you? Yeah, I did talk to you. Okay. I still would like to know where this guy is. If he's around. Huh. Maybe, just maybe. Let me see. Let me see something real quick. Let me see something real quick. Not allowed down here. So that's literally what you're telling me is I can't go down there. Okay. Okay. So you're saying he's somewhere in Saffron, right? They, they literally changed the music right after I talked to him. Okay. <laughs> um, I mean, the only place I haven't gone to is Saffron, is the Saffron City Gym. So, I don't know if I've talked to you yet. Oh, okay, cool. What, Mr. Oak wants me back on the clock? I'm sorry, let's run before it's too late. Oh, that works, okay, cool. I'm so sorry, boss. Yes, yes. Well, finish up your task. This is a lot. <laughs> that was just like 
a lot of random sound effects, and I'm pretty sure all he did was put a chip in. So I think most of that wasn't necessary, but... Good job! Lance, thank you for witnessing a very important event in Self Co history. The Master Ball, it will catch any Pokemon without fail. Since I like you, Lance, I'll let you have our very first retail Master Ball. Not even bad. Thank you, Blue. Are you also interested in a Pokemon battle? I guess I could. I'm kind of rusty, but I suppose I could talk to you. You could talk to me whenever you want a battle. Hey, fuck it. Let's do it. Um... Wait, this is Blue Oak. Do I really want to just jump into a battle with him? I don't know, man. I'm scared, because he might have, like, level 100s. <laughs> like, he says he's rusty, but, like... I don't trust him. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it just for you guys. I think you guys want to see it, so I'm gonna do it. Let's do it. No, wait. <laughs> no, 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 no. Okay, I'm not gonna do that. I was really thinking of just stopping here and be like, nope, that's in the, end, the end of the episode, but fuck it, we're gonna do it. Oh, hey, are you up for a battle? Let's do it. Please, oh God, don't have level 100s. Oh, okay. He looks kind of spiffy. Executor. Level 85. Ooh. Alright, this might be a challenge. This might actually be a challenge. He's going for light screen. Oh no. Oh no. Shit. This might actually be a challenge. That's really scary. Please take it out. Thank God. Oh my goodness, that did way too much damage. I'm terrified now. I don't know what I've gotten myself into, man. I'm gonna go into... I don't know what to do against Reperior. I want to go into Slowbro. But he's gonna have Mega Horn. I already know he's gonna have Mega Horn. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. I don't care. I do not care. I do not care. Slowbro can handle it too. Yep, there it is. Alright. This is so. Ugh, this is so nerve wracking. It didn't take it out. Shit. Light screen fell. Oh, it's because he lights uh, the uh, light screen. Oh, shit. Okay, I'm really terrified of a crit. I had. I had to say crit right after the uh, damage went through, cause. But yeah, I'm really scared of it, so I have to switch. Okay, you can handle one more Mega Horn with a Drain Bunch. So, in fact, you might even be able to take this out. But yeah, Rhyperia has pretty decent bulk, but you still took it out, so that's good. All right, two Pokemon down. What else you got? Blue Pidgeot. Ooh, okay, let's go into Ampharos. Let's see what level this is. 86. Okay. Let's go for the Crystal Bolt. Oh, shit. Okay, let's go for Crystal Bolt. Does it take it out? Ooh, just barely. Just barely. It's going for the full restore. That was expected. If it was 85, I would have taken it out. Yeah, I got the high roll too. Oh, come on, blue! I'm just gonna go for the Thunder Wave, because this Pidgeot's gonna fly anyways, yeah. So fuck it. It flew away, and now I can Dragon Pulse it and just end it. So... He's gonna have Arcanine. He's gonna have Gyarados. And he may have Machamp. Or Aerodactyl. Because I think he, 
he has Aerodactyl sometimes, but he has Machamp. So, uh, we've been able to take out Machamp. We took out Machamp pretty easily in the, uh, Fighting Dojo, but, um, it's 84. I think, I think Blake could still take it out. I think it can. Earthquake. Oh my goodness. I've got to get through this, man. I've got to get through this. Oh my goodness. Okay, we're okay. We're okay. And it's only doing 80 damage. We're okay. Alright, Machamp's gone. If he has Gyarados, I'm really nervous. He's going into Arcanine. But if he has Gyarados, I'm really, really nervous of it having Earthquake. Um... But I'm gonna go into. Do I go into Titar? Might have a fighting move on it. I don't know. I'm gonna go for it. I'm gonna go for it. Okay, so this is level 84. Okay, I think. Uh, I think Dust Devil can just take this thing right out. Oh, I just set up the Sandstorm though. Mmm. I'm gonna go for Dust Devil. It has Toxic? Okay. I think this should one-shot it. It didn't. Shit. Let's just go for another. He may heal, he may not heal. Flamethrower. Okay, we're okay. We're good. No, honest, I should have just healed. The Sandstorm was going to take it out anyways. I should have just healed. Oh well. Alright, let's see your last Pokemon. Oh, he has a T-Tar of his own. Alright, we're going into Glade. I think Glade can honestly one-shot this T-Tar. I think Glade can honestly one-shot it. With Drain Punch. The only thing is the Sandstorm's up now, so... Should be able to one-shot. Good. Oh my goodness, I was so nervous. Blue was defeated. Wow, you're really something else. You're really strong. It's very noble of how you treat your Pokemon. If you want, I'll let you have access to the basement. That's where we grow the apricorns to make Master Balls. Only the most skilled of ball makers can even have a chance at making Master Balls. The fruit tree is also extinct, so we need to make sure that only trustworthy people handle it. Okay, well, um, jeez. I'm gonna go check this place out just to make sure that, like, there's nothing else to it. Can I, like, there's no Pokemon? Okay. Purple Apricorn, okay. Wait, what is this? That looked, okay, that looked a little odd, so I had to check it. Um, I think with that... I'm just surprised I got through that battle without losing a Pokemon, jeez. But I think with that, I'm going to go ahead and end the episode off here. I'd like to thank you guys for watching, like, comment, subscribe, do all that good stuff. In the next episode, we will go ahead and take on Sabrina. And again, hopefully she doesn't have too overpowered of Pokemon. We just saw Blue have like his best Pokemon at 86. I don't know if that means that Sabrina will have Pokemon in the... Uh, late 80s, early 90s, or if she'll just be as strong as Blue. Um, she may even be a little weaker, who knows. But I guess we'll have to find out in the next episode. So, thank you guys for watching, and I will see you in the next episode. Keep living the dream. Goodbye.